Yep, quiet on the set, take one. Ace, are you ready? All right. The Woody, everybody. Now the tongue box doesn't go with it, but this is the Woody line. This is a customized Woody line, and let's take you through a tour. This is exactly 59.9 minus the tongue box. No tongue box, zero tongue box, minus the tongue box, throw the tongue box out in the landfill, no tongue box, 59.9 Woody, 10 by 24. It is gorgeous, come on in, we're gonna show you, walk around, Amanda's got the camera. Let me point out a few things. 10 by 24, 240 square foot house wow. for 59 dollars Stop. This is beautiful. Tell me we have not lost our minds. 59 dollars 240 square feet. Why do you say it wood. again? All wood. All wood. That's why we call it the woody. Called the woody. Come on. This is a log siding. When you get it, we'll caulk all the cracks for you where they seam the corners. That's it. You stain it, you polyurethane mm -hmm. it. I know people are going to say, well, can you stain it for me? Can you stain it for me? No. We ain't got time. We don't now, have we to. may have guys in the side, we'll figure that out, but 59.9, not stained on the outside and not Beautiful. polyurethane on the inside. It is still a DIY if you want to do that, right? Let's walk through. 36 inch door, mm -hmm. wood siding. This is what a flat log siding. Up top is a board and batten, and the roof line. As you guys can see, it's a two stage roof line, and where they come together is windows up top. Wow. It's a glass up you top. You can see it, yeah. We've added a bay window to this customer's home. These, you can purchase this bay window for $2,500 if you want this bay window on your Woody. All wow. Right? So it would be $59.9 plus this bay window is $2,500. And there's the windows but, up top. Is that not look cool? Yeah, it looks cool. Does come with the mini split. The Woody line does come with the mini split. That's great. And a farm style sink. We'll go inside and mm -hmm. show you a little bit more. Just take a look on the other side. at the quality. It's all wood. And this is why it's a woody line, right? Look down here, Amanda. This is a big old house. It is. 59.9. Hey, call, call your, your uh, Dave Ramsey guy. Call them all. Call your money managers and find out if this is not a deal or not. Every house we got here is a deal. It really is. Flat log siding, wood trim. We're going to caulk it so it's waterproof. If you never want to stain it, you don't have to fool with it. It can turn gray, black, silver, or brown. It doesn't matter. Beautiful. It, it's a, this is a white pine siding. If you want to stain it, you can. Now this right here, they do, would do this themselves too. That would be where you put that chink in. If you want it chinked. I, you don't have to. No, it's, it's kind of a, it's right? a simulator of the flat log siding. Yeah. yeah. The shape of this is just so cool looking. Yeah, it is. Um, oh, excuse me. They have a, uh, welcome backwards. Remember, no tongue box, two, two egress windows. All right, Love it. Yep. let's go inside. Now this tongue box, I mean, it's the elephant in the room. Is that something we, we do, apparently? Well, <laughs> apparently. how'd it get here? How'd it get here? Yes, so in here is water, solar, power, all that stuff is inside this tongue box because this is an off-grid home. So if you do want an off-grid home, we can put this tongue and box. And we'll price all that out for you, but oh, that yeah. is you can add. You can add all of our off-grid to any home we build. Yeah. So this is an amazing house for $59.9, 10 by 24. All right. Now we're in the woody line. Let me just run through the floor plan a little bit show you kind of what's going on. There are changes to this house that are not custom to the regular Woody. Of course, the tongue box outside again. I just want to reiterate that. As you come in, the first thing you see is your staircase goes up to the loft. I love putting the staircase in the back because it's not a part of the living room. It doesn't take away from the bathroom. So this whole design was a composite of a bunch of ideas from a lot of homes we've built. Staircase, ample headroom, nice height for your risers, easy to tread up and down, so it's real convenient. We do have space under here. The Woody line will have a water heater under the stairs. The reason there's not a water heater here is because he had an off-grid tongue box. We couldn't put the water heater there. So now it's in the bathroom, and I'll show you how that's kind of taken away from some storage, but the, the water, the Woody line will be different. All right, so you come in, here's your kitchen. Of course, your butcher block. Your really nice cabinets, dovetail, all maple, mm -hmm. farm style sink, 
<clears throat> stove top, range hood, microwave, right? Yep. And this is the kitchen that you get, yep. all right? With a gooseneck faucet, 203 window. Now, before I go into the living room, I want to show you. This is what really blew me away when you showed me this. I love the stairs in the back. I think that's just genius yeah. to have them out of the way and it's behind the door. It's not a usable space. It's not anyway. a part of their house. It's not a part of the yeah, house. You don't, it's just a tool. But when you showed me these two things, really, really important. So when I designed this, all of our homes are, are always, they were always lacking closets, right? Oh, yes. And I thought, okay, let's, let's push the length of the house. Let's add, if we can, some closet space. But let's keep the price down. Yeah. And I did that by not finishing the wood inside here. Mm -hmm. and not finishing the outside. All right? Now, if you do want it finished, you want it a little bit different, we may be able to add those. But this is the true woody line. It's all unfinished wood inside and out. Mm -hmm. This here is a pantry. And now the door, this bathroom door is a double functioning door. This is the bathroom that closes off. And when the bathroom's open, it closes off your pantry. Right. All right? Kind of like that. But, Which is not a big deal. You know, with a pantry even, I would probably put just a little curtain. If I yeah. put anything, if you right. have everything in there nice and neat. I mean, your, yours is open Mine's at your open. House. I love an open pantry. But the amount of storage that can go in this, this pantry. I mean, like, what's the probably the depth and the... Look at me, man. I'm a huge human being. <laughs> look how big I am. You can store three of me in here. You know what it looks like? It looks like... What a, does it look like, Amanda? It looks like a, a vertical... It looks like what? A vertical coffin. <laughs> A vertical coffin. Look. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, going on to the We're next moving one. On. Moving on. Moving on. All right. So we got that what? pantry. Now look here. <laughs> gone. Wait a minute. Gone, gone again. <laughs> I'm, I'm gone again. I'm gone again. Oh my God. You can hide ah! three Randy's. <laughs> No, this could be, hey, there's people that need more food they're going to put in here. <laughs> or you could put a shelf and clothes, right? Uh, listen, <clears throat> this is no small thing. We just, uh, remember last week, I don't know who we talked to, and they were talking about closets. And yep. this solves all your problems, oh, but you're so not cool. done. I'm not done if you keep on. Let's go. <laughs> and then we got this huge living room. All right, let me see. One, two, three. Three, that's three, six, nine, ten. This, okay, so this is a little over a hundred square foot inside the living room. Wow. Now, you guys remember the bay window is extra. It's $2,500 for the it bay window. It is extra. Let me show the end of it right there. And that's what we were just talking about with the Incredit Cottage. Look, look, look. We're adding a bay window. Uh, this is the bay window that we You know what? This would be my cottage. bed. I wouldn't even need a bed. I could Why? sleep right here. <laughs> I'm not too against that. Isn't this nice? Yeah. This is a big bay window. $2,500. All right. Mm -hmm. So, and of course, you've probably seen it when I was over here. This is the washer and dryer stack. Wow. Wash yes. and dryer. If you wanted to close it off and you didn't want a washer and dryer, look at more closet space. You wow. Have. But that's made for a stack washer and dryer. That's amazing. I love it. Mini split, of course. That comes with it. Yep. We are Dang. adding a mini split to the woody line. You're including And a farm in the style pot. sink. These wires here, that's for the solar. This Remember, this home is off grid. Yeah. Ceiling fan comes with the house. Yep. Now you guys notice the ceiling. The ceiling is not an A-framed house, right? Yeah. So it comes down a little bit. I like it. It's yes. a little more cottagey. Yeah. Because it's not as vaulted. Well, also the choice of wood, the beadboard is very cottagey yeah. looking. That looks this nice. This whole woody line is about being a cottage. Yes. And we got our cottage line, but this is a woody line, all right? Wow. So as you guys can look up here. Oh, right? now this is cool. You got to do the pull up. Yep. Oh yeah, look at that. You got to christen it. Yep. So up there, all show. the air can get up through here, going up into your line. Wow. Isn't that cool? It's, and wait till we go up the stairs and show you. I mean, <laughs> it just blows you away. So the mini split, all the air can just very easily go up into the Oh, wall. Randy, I mean, explain how it feels in here. I had to turn it up, and I get hot all the time. Yeah. It's like there's not a place in here that's not cool. It's yeah. took care of. It's mini fine. split is... is it can handle over 600 square foot of house. This is 240. Now let me back up and show this living room again because that is, that's a lot of space. Yeah. Okay. And you know what, if you did, if you did not want to use the loft of sleeping, there's still ample room downstairs. Oh yeah, absolutely. You know? All right, under there, oh, we gotta go into oh, the bathroom. Oh, I was gonna say we haven't shown the yeah. bathroom. And I'll explain to you a little bit of the changes. This one's gonna be different than our normal woody line. Okay. All right, I'm gonna go in here. Man, did you come in? 
Mm -hmm. This is a 36 inch shower. Big really nice. Shower. Really good. Underneath the staircase and the loft. Yep. Here, you guys can see a little bit of storage. More storage. You do, and you get a vanity, mm -hmm. a toilet, yep. and you got room to walk. Look how you got room to walk around here. I'm going to shut the door. Yeah, I'm over here. Yep. See them? Yep. There's your boots. There's my boots. It's raining today, so yeah. it's and a then boot day. Here, this water heater would normally not be here. Right. The water heater is going to go into the steps. Now, it's an electric water heater unless you choose to go gas. Mm -hmm. This is another form of another storage. Another closet. Can't do this because this water heater, this homeowner needed a water heater here, which is great. That's fine. But look at the shelving. That, and he can still, or he or she can still put shelving in here and do this. Oh, yeah. But look at the space. So, we've got one, two, three big storage areas, Amanda. And possibly, well, you're going to have a washer and dryer, so you're going to do that. So, three... Right here's the third one. Under the stairs is going to be some, and then alongside the left side of the shed. And if you did the uh, the combo, like you were talking about, if you do the combo washer and dryer, you can have a hanging yeah, uh, closet you got it. above it. So the combo goes underneath the countertop, 36 inches, oh, yeah. and then you get space above it. Okay. Great. Oh, my God. Let's go upstairs. So this, the highlights of this home, now normally, now I'm going to finish my sentence, but I looked at this. There will be a window here. So if you do not go with a bay window, there will be another window, a 3040 regular window. So in the living room, we'll have three windows in here, okay? The other window is in the bathroom and in the kitchen. What's the matter? So, which means that's like, what, about two foot? You'll have two foot more space right there without the bay window. More space. What are you talking about? Well, I mean, like... No, no, no. The wall will be, be right here. The window oh, the will be right here. The wall will be right there. The window okay. will be right here. I see. Okay, okay. Yeah. You got more space with the bay. Okay, I see. Because it's sitting outside. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. We ready else? to go up? Yep. I'm thinking about... Am I missing anything here? Ample plugs, everybody. Look at the plugs around here. Two, four, six, seven plugs. Now, they put a plug right here. This is a designated circuit mm -hmm. for a refrigerator. Okay. To set your fridge right here. Apartment size. Well, you could have a full size fridge. You could have down, up. You could put a platform, put mm -hmm. a smaller one, however you want to do it. Yeah. Okay. As you live in here. Yeah. All right. You know what? I'm going to have you go upstairs. Yeah, I'll go up. And show everybody we got the steps, or dirty a little Look bit. Look, I know. I stepped on it with my boots. You're and awful. Stuff. I, pretty much. Wow. Let me just kind of show you from here. The windows, I don't know, what kind of what kind of windows would you call those? How well, those are fixed windows, fixed glass. Okay. Um, we think that we may, we might be able to get, we're trying to try to change it up a little bit and put uh, hopper windows that can open. I love the fixed glass. That's just so pretty. Now, we do have egress windows on both sides of the loft. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, right there, tons right there. of natural light up there, man. Like, wow. Yeah. That's like super wow. And then here's the stairs going down, and you told how tall they are or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, they're easy to navigate up and down. They're not too tall. Yep. And look, a plug down at the bottom yeah, of the Yeah, there's steps. a plug at the bottom. Well, you can put something like those air freshener things. Yeah. And then you know what? You got a plug, of course, at your kitchen. Another one here at this. And then you've got your stove top. Good grief. I love this house. Ah, great Airbnb. Mm -hmm. All right? Because you could have a, a sleeper sofa down. You could have... You know, of course, this is two bedroom, mm -hmm. accommodate two adults, I mean, two couples, um, or a family of four. Man, really nice. Yeah, 59.9, really nice. Amanda. Wow. Yeah. Now, if somebody needed somewhere to put it, say, I want to buy the house, but I got to have somewhere to put it. We're doing, we're developing the Buffalo Creek area of our mountain. If you want a lot in the Buffalo Creek, it's a $10,000 key money or registration fee, mm -hmm. and it reserves your lot on Buffalo Creek Mountain, and you go back through our videos, you can see that beautiful, beautiful mountain so setting. Yeah. This is what we want to fill that mountain full of, mm -hmm. are these beautiful woody lines, because it, it fits the woods, it fits the mountain decor. Like, you could actually put that bay window or a picture window, if you want to add a picture window, mm -hmm. let's say you're up on the mountain, and maybe that's your view, we could put a picture window or two picture windows. So we can add amenities. The only thing you cannot change is the floor plan, mm -hmm. the kitchen, the loft, the roof lines, none of the window placements. Yeah. None we can of the structure. Re we can replace windows and, and then maybe not include one. Now, I have a question about, can you put a window there? If you don't have that tongue box, could you put a window at the stairs? Add a window. No. Add a window. I don't like adding a window. Okay. 
near staircase. Okay. I know you seem like it would be nice to have one, but mm -hmm. if you're coming down the steps and you trip and your hand goes through the window, now we got to put a safety glass mm, there. Right? I see what you're saying. Yeah. I never thought about that. Okay. And yep. then just another view of upstairs. Look how pretty that is up there. All the wood. I can't tell you how warm it feels in here because of the wood. When, when you haven't been in a house that has wood in it and then you walk in here, the smell, the feel, yeah. the look, it's, it's warm. Yeah. yeah. So it gives you all the feels. I don't know. Yeah. 59.9, 10 by 24, Woody Line, order now. Mm -hmm. We will be starting to build these things rapidly. We're trying to make this actually because the, the this is going to be a manufactured home. We want to yeah. put this kind of like we do the Incredibox. Mm -hmm. We're going to try to build these things. And that will take us a while to get to. Right now, they're just stick built. We're going to be going with it. But that's why our price is fifty nine nine. And I'm sure the the homeowner of this one, he's the very first one, even though it had it added oh, solar yeah. and it's different. I bet they are excited. This is a beautiful home, especially with the amenities yeah. that he's placed on them. Yeah. That bay window is amazing. It's so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, give us a call. Uh, you can email us at sales at incredibletinyhomes.com. Mm -hmm. um, give us a call. If you want to come and see this, it's probably not going to be here very long. Yeah. We'll be building a couple more here shortly. So, um, Hopefully, you're the one we're building for. <laughs> All right, everybody. Great. Thank you. And uh, subscribe, thumbs up. Let us know what you think about this. And email us at Sales Incredible Tiny Home Center. I want the woody line. All right. Bye. Bye. Where'd eights go? I snuck out.